Hello everyone, I hope you are doing well. Today, we are going to continue module 9. We will have top time lesson. In this lesson, you are going to read a text, then answer some questions. This lesson, you will find it in your student book page 113 and in your workbook page 116. Are you ready to play a puzzle game? In this game, you should rearrange the pieces to form a complete picture. Are you ready? Let's start. Phenomenal! That was fun! Now think of these questions. Have you ever seen these animals before in Qatar? Do you know their names? What do you know about them? Great! Now let's first discover their names. Arabian gazelles Jackals Falcons Oryx Desert Hedgehogs Are you ready to learn more information about these animals? Let's read. Open your student book at module 9, page 113, activity number 1. In this activity, you are going to read and match each description, A to E, with the correct photo of the animal 1 to 5. Are you ready? Let's start. Animals in Qatar. Qatar is home to a great number of animals and has some amazing wildlife. These are some of the animals you can see around the country. Jackals. The golden jackal looks like a wolf, but it is smaller, and it lives in the desert. It has got shorter legs than a wolf, but a longer body. Arabian gazelles. They are beautiful animals, and they are very fast. They've got two short horns, big eyes, and a short tail. In Qatar, people call them reem, oryx. They are antelopes with two long horns. The oryx is the national animal of Qatar. Falcons. There are six kinds of falcons in Qatar, and people love them. For years, Qataris trained these birds to hunt with them. Desert hedgehogs. This cute little animal is one of the smallest kinds of hedgehog. It has got small ears and a dark nose. It goes out at night to find food, insects, birds' eggs, and sometimes fruit or plants. You did well. Now please check your answers. A goes with 2, B goes with 1, C goes with 4, D goes with 3, and E goes with 5. 
Now, it's your turn. Pause the video and read it by yourself. Remember, you have to read the text very carefully because we have some questions for you. Are you ready now to practice? Now let's play the the quiz show game. In this quiz, you are going to read the description carefully and guess the animal. This one is an example. It looks like a wolf, but it is smaller. Remember, you can always go back to your student book and find the answer at the text. The answer of this example is Golden Jackal. Are you ready? Let's start. It has got two short horns. What is it? Did you know it? Excellent! It is Arabian gazelle. It is an antelope with two long horns. What is it? Did you know it? Perfect! The answer is Oryx. It goes out at night to find food. Remember, you can go back to your student book to find the answer. Well done! The answer is... Desert Hedgehog. Perfect! People train it to hunt with them. What is it? Did you know it? The answer is Falcon. Great! You did well. That was really fun. Let's practice more. Now grab your workbook and open it at module 9, page 116, activity number 1. In this activity, you are going to guess the animal, then write a sentence for each one of them. For example, number one is the golden jackal. The golden jackal is smaller than the wolf. Now pause the video and try to do the rest by yourself. Now remember, you can go back to your student book and find these sentences at the text. Very good, you did great. Check your answers, please. Two is the Arabian gazelle. The Arabian gazelle has got two short horns. Three, falcon. People train falcons to hunt with them. Number four is oryx. The oryx is an antelope with two long horns. Number five is the desert hedgehog. The desert hedgehog goes out at night to find food. Very good. Thank you so much. I have a question for you. Let's think together. What is your responsibility towards these animals? What should you do to protect them? Always remember, to protect these animals, you should Keep their home clean and safe. Whenever you see them, do not to try to feed them nor hunt them. As always, don't forget to do your daily assessment within 24 hours on Teams. Thank you so much and I hope to see you very soon. Bye-bye.